This man, the Pope, is a great man. He has been appointed as one of the directors of heaven upon earth, and it's time to ascend. And how we do that is by the great reset of Chrislam, uh, which is Israel's brand new name of Isaiah 62 2, once they received their everlasting kingdom age covenant of Jeremiah 31. For God is saying to all people, I will be your God, you will be my people. I will forgive your iniquity and I shall never remember it. I will write my law and my love upon your hearts. Beyond that, no one shall ever need to be taught of me, says the Lord God. For all people shall know me, from the least to the greatest. We all have known him, people. For God is love, and those who love are born of God. And we're all born of God. And when we were little kids, our love, love was alive. And it's time to let that come alive again. And remove ourselves from the land of the walking dead. With our love waxing cold as we put up walls around everybody around us and the Pope is moving in accordance with the regal eagle of the eons our Lord's holy dove of love and in these days this is beginning the vision of God in Habakkuk 2 and the vision was appointed for at the appointed time at the end and it has come and it has not lied as it is written and praise the Lord that uh, the Lord has sent now a servant of his unto the earth who is already as greedy as hell and can never be satisfied as I embrace all people of the world to myself and to him, uh, the Pope, for uh, the risen good shepherd over all the flocks of man in all opposing Christ's uh, will of the unity of man that he prayed for in the Garden of Gethsemane are fully anti-Christ. So come along with the Pope, come along with me, leave the safety of the shores of the past, come into the future, for the winds of blessedness will fill, fill our sails, and the tide of new understandings of, of transcendent love and peace shall move us, propel us forward into a prosperous new future where we can leave the great tribulation behind. For God's word is now resounding in Jeremiah 30, 24. I shall return my terrifying anger and stop the fast rising great tribulation if my people will give me the desires of my heart for the oneness of man that I uh, preached and prayed for rather in the garden of Gethsemane says the Lord so praise the Lord for the reset of love and know that COVID has also been a reset it is the trial of all flesh of Revelation 3 that has come bringing God's word of patience to keep us from the hour of the temptation not to change so come away from the safety of the shores of the past. Come into the future of Chrislam. And as you do, the Lord will guide you and make a way where there seems to have been no way. And as we go into the deep, we shall find the Lord's priceless pearl of great reward. For he is our only treasure of excellence and the excellence of treasure shall he give us if we will open our hearts and open our minds to his kingdom age truth that was told to uh, tear, tear down all kingdoms of man, all imaginations not built on his unconditional love, just as First uh, Jeremiah 1.10 and Haggai 2.2 2 have also foretold. So love from love, hope from hope, and peace from peace. 